Hi, my name's Kelly Devaney. I'm the trainer for our Beauty Collective products and today I thought I would just feature some of our beautiful oils that we've recently been promoting on our newsletters and on our website on how you can possibly utilize some of the tools that you might have in your home care beauty kit such as the Jade Roller. So to emphasize sort of the benefits of using a jade roller we're looking at increasing the lymphatic drainage or removal of toxins within the skin we're using the rollers to help cool and calm because particularly with jade it is a very cold um, natural stone that is going to help reduce inflammation as well as increase that lymphatic drainage or toxin elimination in the skin so particularly if you've got a skin that is suffering from dull um, early lines and wrinkles maybe a bit of elasticity um, loss in the skin so you're starting to see a little bit of drooping in the skin and you're wanting to tone and firm or maybe you're a menopausal or rosacea skin you've got lots of heat and redness in the skin you're wanting to cool and calm or even an acne skin where you've got those inflammation pustules where you've got those hot eruptions in the skin one of these is going to be a lifesaver for you so these are a really hot trending item at the moment so i'm pretty sure a lot of you have seen if not have one of these at home already so how do i use it and that's what i thought i'd take you through today a couple of the um quick little tips um, and movements that you can use um, every day or every second day to help improve your skincare products, um, maximize the results in your skin, particularly at the moment when we unfortunately can't go into our beautiful salons and spas to have our treatments. Let's show you how you can sort of perk up the skin a little by using one of these. So the three oils that we have um, that are perfect to go with using a roller, um, and mind you, you don't have to use an oil, you can use serums that are water-based, it's just that it may not roll as easily. So keep that in mind as well. I'm gonna focus on oil-based um, serums today. So the three serums that we have that go beautifully with a roller, I'll start with the Fitamere products. Um, the first one is the um, Fitamere Oligo Force Advance, which is perfect for early signs of aging and any hyperpigmentation or dark spots. So this is a beautiful oil with our amazing Oligo Mare um, ions, rich in seawater ions to increase cell vitality, to hydrate the skin, oxygenate the skin, and it also has our blue algae, our micro algae, algae that is fantastic for lightening those dark hyperpigmentation patches so this oil can be used morning and night or either or personally I love using these sorts of oils at night time because that replaces my cream um, and it also with the benefit of using an oil at night you're actually giving your skin that extra layer of protection against what we refer to as transepidermal water loss. Bit of a tongue twister, I know, but basically when you're in bed, um, you can go for really long periods, um, eight to 12 hours of not having any water. So when you wake up, if you've had air cons, heaters, electric blankets, um, a fireplace or a fan going, your skin will have lost moisture while you were sleeping. So when you wake up, sometimes your skin can look rather dull, sallow, um, it's really thirsty. So when you do put your moisturizers on, it sort of disappears super quickly. And even when you go to put your foundation on, it sort of feels like it's being sucked up as well. By using an oil um, at night instead of your moisturizer, it actually helps to prevent that transepidermal water loss occurring. So um, incredible. Um, I refer to them sort of more as a, as a food booster for the skin. So the Oligomare Force is fantastic for early lines and wrinkles extra nourishment and also any hyperpigmentation patches. If you've got more that menopausal, sensitive, fragile skin, we would always recommend our beautiful rose soy oil. Now this is smells divine. It's got the beautiful rose in it. It's also based on jojoba oil. So it's a, probably one of our lightest oils. Um, so if you don't wanna feel like you do have an oil on your skin, this might be the perfect option. 
a fantastic food booster that's sort of in between both of those is our Pavonia Vitaminic. Um, now again, with all of these products, one pipette or one pump of the product is all you're going to need to coat your skin. Um, less is best with all of our products because they are so active and they penetrate so quickly. Now with the Pavonia Vitaminic, you've got the beautiful mandarin. So this is a vitamin C based um, oil that's used at night time. Um, it's hazelnut based and um, it's going to have your vitamin E in there, your mandarin, so it's going to help increase um, plumping and fine lines and wrinkles, hydration, just the vitality of the skin so a gorgeous light oil now I'm going to use this one today um, just to demonstrate so one pump is all I needed and obviously a clean skin so I've already done the cleanse on my skin I've got nothing on so I'm just going to apply the oil to my skin down my neck and coat it over often if you've feel that this, the, any of these oils are too oily on your skin and you feel like a bit of a, an oily fish, you've used too much. It's as simple as that. It's not the product. So less is best. One pipette of the Fitamere or one pump of the Pavonia is all you're going to need. Okay, so our jade rollers. So the jade rollers are all designed to increase lymphatic drainage, which is toxin elimination. Helps to reduce puffiness in the skin, particularly around the eyes. Um, you've also got cooling, calming, so any redness or inflammation in the skin. So that monthly breakout or that um, broken capillaries along the, um, the, the cheek area this is going to help to cool and calm the skin as well um, and also just in general lift so what I'm going to do is I'm going to work one half of my face so you can actually see the difference after just a couple of minutes of doing a roller so key stroke movements it's lymphatic drainage so we're draining out to our main lymph nodes so on the on the neck area we've got our pulmonary artery down here that's where we're wanting to send a lot of our neck toxins to get flushed away. On the face it's up along the jawline, out towards the ear, okay, up towards the temple and they're our key drainage points and also up through the scalp. So there that's the way we're going to direct our movement. So on the neck area you're best making sure you're going downward. So it's just rollering down and I'm not pressing too hard and you want to make sure that when you're going over the esophagus, it's not hard because the last thing you want to do is sort of choke yourself. So we roll it down. Now, if like me, you suffer a little bit of neck pain, I love working the roller into the mastoid muscle there, which runs right up to the ear and you can really work in and help to alleviate a bit of that tension because tension will also affect your facial muscles. Depending on the time that you have, I often find three to four is going, three to five, sorry, is going to be your best um, amount of movements in each area. So this time I'm just working along my jawline, okay, up on the chin and jawline itself now. So it feels really cool and calm, okay, and then outwards. Now the other thing is too, I've, I've often had people say, oh, you know, I've got one of these at home, but it actually squeaks. That's because you've got metal on stone. So it's really important that when you're, um, as you're working with this, the oils will naturally work into where they join and it will stop that, that squeakiness. Or you can always drop a little bit of the oil on there and massage it in. But it's just purely because you've got metal on stone. Now I'm working the nasolabe area here. Now if you've got one of the rollers that actually has a small end, that's where I find this to be perfect. Okay. And you can also go over the lips. Again, increasing circulation. So it can often help to really plump up and define those lips. Working upwards, I'm going to work out along the jawline. Okay. 
If you had a small one, you could go extra close to the I.O., particularly for those bags and puffiness. Third eye, you can give a little bit of a rub and then up. Up. You can actually see the flushing in my skin as I'm rollering there. Obviously, again, we're not pressing too hard, but we're just flushing away those toxins. Here I'm going over my actual eyebrow and my upper eyelid. Over the forehead. And hopefully you can actually see a difference in the half face that I have done compared to the one that I haven't. So you can see underneath my eyes there, you can also see the, see the nasolabe, how that's reduced on that side. Okay, and also a little bit of lifting there. I don't know if you can see that. Okay, so these are incredible tools that you can use. We have amazing products that you can utilize them with. Um, and simply it depends on the time that you have each day. So three to five movements each time um, is ideal and you could do that daily or every second or third day depending on your time. Um, you can always pop a mask on afterwards if you've got a mask handy um, to continue the infusion benefits of what you've just worked in with your roller. So hopefully that's been some useful tips for you. Um, these are easy to clean as well, just a nice warm soapy water um, and also just leave them dry out in the sun. The sun will actually help to re-energize the stones in between use as well. So hopefully that gives you some extra um, tips on when and how you can use these beautiful rollers um, with your Fitamir or your Pavonia skincare. And I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye.